What is going on guys, this is Dr. Maybe here today and we're back with some more drama happening around the universe today and it's not a good day for Amber Rosas because she's getting sued with a big, big lawsuit from Ace of Diamonds, the owners of Ace of Diamonds because like an idiot, Amber Rose, although she is a sexy me beauty, uh, love the hair, uh, no, 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 she doesn't have any hair but I love her personally, uh, she's getting hit with a big lawsuit after like an idiot uh, saying that she bought the place when she didn't uh, or maybe someone told her she did but they scammed their money I don't know what's this deal but Ace of Diamonds the owners of Ace of Diamonds are hitting her with a lawsuit as they should because you know that's the the, the most known strip club in LA and uh, you know you, you just want to make sure that nothing like this ever happens so you're standing your ground so I understand that so Amber Rose is not a lucky person and hopefully she can you know defend this off without any emotional toll but other than that guys Amber Rose today, not a happy camper. And on to another news, Katy Perry and Orlando Bloom. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, although this hasn't been a very, very long relationship, it is over, ladies and gentlemen, after one year, and uh, they took a statement from TMZ Live, I saw a statement from TMZ Live saying that they were saying that they wanted uh, some time and respect, the respectful and some time, taking away some time, usually something happened, nobody knows, but yeah, Katy Perry, the ultra feminist, and Orlando Bloom is gone, I'm pretty sure Orlando left because she's a crazy, you know, B. but other than that, I think, uh, I think this is good for everybody, including Katy Perry and Orlando Bloom. Next on to news, this guy is one of my favorite rappers. I have loved this rapper ever since he was 14 and released his first like rap, I think. It was a beauty, and I fell in love with Kodak Black's music. But unfortunately, he is going back to jail, boys. Obviously, uh, Kodak was charged with, I think, sex assault and other charges, but he got off because of probation and, uh, and good behavior and house arrest. House arrest. But... He didn't do a smart move as he went to a strip club, which the probation wouldn't have allowed. And I don't think they have a bail set for right now. And he might go to prison for a long time, boys. So Kodak Black, free to Kodak Black, whoever tattooed their Kodak Black's name on their lip might not be a happy camper. So yeah, Kodak Black went back to jail uh, for, you know, going to a strip club, not listening to the rules uh, via his probation officer. And other stuff like that. But unfortunately, one of the greatest rappers of this day, even though he's only like 20, I think, is going back to jail. So yeah, that's unfortunate. And in other news, in Israel, yes, Stoudemire is irrelevant. He is garbage at basketball, but Stoudemire is apparently a homophobe. In a, in a recent interview uh, taken by the Israel, Israeli media in there, um, while he's playing basketball overseas, they asked him if he would be comfortable with the homosexual in the locker room. And Sotomayor said no. He said, and I quote, If I had to, I would go shower in the, in the gym across, etc., etc. And I, I just I just think that, you know what? Okay, obviously you can have your opinion, but that's kind of disrespectful, man. You know, I'm a, support, I'm a supportive LGBTQ um, supporter. But Stoudemire, I think he shouldn't have said that. Even if he does truly believe that, which I think he does. He got some macho. He's got some boss for saying that. I wouldn't have said it on publicly like that. But that's Stoudemire's choice. And on to another news. Nikki, Nikki, Nikki. Holy shit. She got the fuck bodied by Remy Ma. And I don't think she's doing anything after getting bodied like that. All she is doing is, uh, you know, liking some hate comments on some Instagram posts and Meek Mill too. And she's just acting like a loser. And uh, sources say that I'm pretty sure she doesn't write her own shit. I'm pretty sure most people in the industry don't write their own shit, but I'm pretty sure she's looking for someone to come up with something special. She might be sucking some D to get that, you know, that on 100 um, lyrics for to body Remy Ma back. Uh, apparently, the game has been in question. He's trying to get that booty, uh, and he's trying to, you know, make... Uh, he's trying to get Nikki's booty, uh, trying to get everybody riled up and saying, oh, taking shots at Meek Mill, basically... But yeah, uh, Nicki Minaj is not doing anything after getting bodied by Remy Ma. Remy Ma bodied the shit out of her. And we're just waiting, everybody's waiting for her response. 
And so, yeah, guys, that's all of the drama, the highlight of the drama today. Amber Rose, not a cappy camper. Katy Perry, the ultra feminist, crazy mother. Ugh. She's breaking up with Orlando Bloom. Can't blame Orlando. I'm pretty sure he figured out she was crazy. Either way, they're separated. And Kodak Black is back to jail. Stoudemire's a homophobe. And Nicki Minaj ain't doing shit. Probably sucking some dick. <laughs> To get that lyrics back. My name is Dr. Mamie. Please leave a like and comment what you think about the subject. Make sure to subscribe. Check out my following social media. I love y'all beautiful motherfuckers. Peace.